Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how you can use a VPN program, in this case NordVPN, um, to watch BBC iPlayer abroad. Now you probably know if you try and access BBC or any of the other UK TV sites, um, when you're outside the UK they don't always work. Um, this is because it checks your IP address and it won't let you access. Now for instance, if you go to the BBC site from outside the UK, You'll go. You'll get to a site like this, which is the, actually the um, international version of the BBC iPlayer. And you'll notice at the top here, you're missing all the um, the video and the radio and the TV programs and the iPlayer tab itself. If you try and go directly to the iPlayer site. You'll find you can get there, I'll just show you now. They'll let you go to the BBC iPlayer and then you can see all the channels and it, it really is a marvellous site if you haven't seen it. Um, but if you try and play something, uh, so I try and play this country which is a very very funny drama, comedy, uh, and you click OK, uh, you'll get this error message here, the BBC iPlayer only works in the UK. It's looked up my IP address seen I'm not in the UK and then blocked me. Okay, so the same will happen on ITV, Channel 4, Channel 5 and such like that. Okay, let's just close this down and see what we're going to do about it. So what we have to do is to basically fool the um, BBC site that we are in the uh, UK, even if we're not. Uh, now, unfortunately, you can't change your IP address, um, but what you can do is hide it and use something called a VPN um, to convince the BBC or any other site they're in a different country. Okay, so this is a program I'm going to use called NordVPN, which um, I've been subscribing for many years. Now, there's a couple of things you should know about um, Nord. Um, there's rumours going around that sometimes these programmes don't work, and it's usually, well, in fact, it's nearly always because of the IP address being blocked. Now, what you should remember with um, NordVPN is um, it's got thousands of servers and there's features here called Quick Connect. If too many people are using the same IP address at once, um, the BBC will be able to de detect it. They can't detect the VPN, but they can detect if 10,000 people are using the same IP address to watch EastEnders or something like that. So what you should do is try and pick up, um, if you go on the NordVPN website, they've got actually uh, a list of um, servers which they optimize for BBC iPlayer. They don't advertise it much. There's a link in the description below. And um, what you can do is build up a, um, don't use Auto Connect, use, pick a few servers, uh, try them out, and when you've um, tried them, if you like them and they work with BBC, just favorite them, okay? So I'm going to choose one that I use quite often um, for the United Kingdom. Remember, there are hundreds of um, servers in the UK as well, so you've got plenty to pick from. Okay, so it's now connected to uh, one of my favorite servers in the UK. Now, now I will appear to have a UK IP address. So let me just start BBC again. Let me just go to this home page. Okay, so we're going to the home page and let's go to BBC iPlayer. And here we go. Okay, here we're on the BBC iPlayer site and let's scroll down. Remember, we've got a um, UK IP address now. So let's go and watch this program. And you can see I tried to watch this before uh, and I got a little message up here saying it wasn't working. Um, this time it will work because you can see it's streaming perfectly well. It's a very funny show, this, this country, if you um, like comedies. I'm going to stop it there because we get told off if we stream too much from the BBC onto YouTube. But you can see it works perfectly and this is because I've I picked one of my favorite NordVPN servers and um, I've got about 10 that I use regularly. If you do get blocked through one, don't worry, just switch to another one and as I say, build up your favorites. Don't use the auto connect because in that case you can sometimes... Um, find you're being lumped in with everybody else especially if you're from a similar location and you can find that that ip address will be temporarily blocked in 
um, by the BBC. Okay, I'll finish the video now. I hope you enjoyed it. So that was um, using NordVPN. It's in February 2020 to watch the BBC. Um, it's well worth it. It's one of the cheapest. In fact, I think it is the cheapest VPN you can get. And it works perfectly well for your needs. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.